welcome to lips and liner I'm gonna do a little bit of a kind of like um, what you call this kind of like a review on um, and, um, nails like not these kind of nails these kind of nails and these kind of nails and these kind of nails and these kind of nails okay so I tried out some of these ones the other day these impress nails they actually worked really well um, I loved how easy they were they fit to my nail really good the only thing that I had an issue with was that my like when I would like play with my hair which I play with my hair a lot my hair would actually kind of get stuck in the nails so I'm gonna see if these ones are any better so I'm gonna try these out see what I think um, so I try to open this already and it's somehow kind of like I don't know it's kind of hard to open like that's one thing I'm not so fond about right now um, one of the things that's like a really really big deal going on right now in the United States is that um, Dell bought out EMC EMC is kind of like a storage provider um, kind of like uh, the way the cloud works and stuff like that um, anyway it was a 67 billion dollar purchase and it's considered the largest deal in tech history so that's pretty amazing to me um, Dell didn't really have the money to do it they had to like I guess borrow money somehow or something like that anyway okay so to get this open I actually had to just use one of these to pry it open but anyway um the owner and CEO's name is Michael, and he, oh, these things are super sticky. You don't even have to pull off the back. Oh, dang. Oh, dang. Okay. Whoa. So there's no, like, just, you just have to stick them on. Okay. So, all right. This is what I'm thinking. It doesn't have, like, a picture, does it? Okay. It's not really showing how to put these on like it doesn't say anything um let me see if directions say anything because this is kind of like like these things literally just like pop out like you literally i mean like i'll show you so the inside of this thing is sticky and you don't pull anything off from the inside so whoa so you don't you can't really tell like what size is supposed to go on your finger you i guess you just kind of like guess or something I don't really like that um okay there's some extra little sticky things on the inside here um so i guess if one of them pops off or something you've got backups for extra glue um so all right there's different sizes so these things are numbered underneath so let me see if I can show you guys. Okay, so underneath they're numbered. So I guess if you know the number of your fingernails, you don't have to worry about it. But I don't know the numbers of my fingernails. And something that I actually am going to do is use um, an alcohol swab kind of thing or something like that um, to clean my nail real quick to make sure that they don't have any oils on there so the stuff will stick. These things right here... Um, they're actually lens cleaning wipes. You can buy them online. You can get them at like stores all over. But they actually have alcohol in them. It's for um, cleaning like lenses, eyeglasses, binoculars, microscopes, and that kind of stuff. I'm actually just going to use one of these because these things like are like you can smell them. It's mainly just alcohol. So I'm just going to rub that on there clean off my nail real quick and see what this looks I'm not really sure if I'm gonna like how these go on because you're not gonna know it says it's supposed to last up to a week um, I bet mine will probably last like a day because I'm gonna be doing a lot of stuff I don't know we'll see the other ones that I wore the other day they lasted I mean 
they lasted like a day and a half or something they're just so much cheaper than going and getting your nails done done and I don't really want to have my nails done constantly I would like to have them done for like special occasions like tomorrow I'm gonna to be doing some um, presentation kind of stuff so I thought oh well I'll do something to my nails right now so now my nails feel really like um, clean they don't feel greasy at all because a lot of times you'll have like grease and soap or something left on your nails so I want to have to try and figure out how to do this um okay so what I've realized is that you want I want to show you something real quick so it doesn't really have major directions but this is what I'm going to explain so I'll show you this up close and personal so here's a little nail right tiny um the part that is either the thinnest or the narrowest is going to go to the inside of the nail generally, just depending on what's going on. So I'm going to try this on my pinky. Yeah, that fits really well. Okay, so I guess the way this works is there's two of each size. So you get 24 nails, 12 sizes two charms, six adhesive tapes. So the extra adhesive tapes are the ones that are gonna go on if like one pops off or something, you've got an extra backup. So now I have to find, I'm not sure what size this was. I think this was, dang it, I don't know. Here's the first one. Looks super cute, there's like glitter on that one side and then it goes to the other side, it's pretty cute. Let me see what this says. I can't tell and these things are just like so not easy to, pull out of here so I don't know what to do um, I'm gonna take just a bobby pin I'm gonna take just a bobby pin and like to try and get these things out without messing them up I'm just gonna like push it kind of like like right here okay this one isn't one to come out so I'm just gonna kind of like do that because it like automatically sticks and then I'll pull that off there Okay, now let me see real quick. Okay, so the glue goes all the way. Dang, okay. I'm not sure if I'm doing this right. Let me look real quick again. Okay. Glitter. I put this one the wrong way. Damn it. I think I put it on the wrong way. Okay, so to pop it off, I was going to have to go underneath and pull. Oh, that is a lot of glue stuff coming off. Okay, so that one's pretty much ruined. Because, like, with this design, you're going to have to have them be the right size and everything. So let me see. What is this? Oh! <gasps> And I can't tell, like I really can't. Like this is a lot more hard, like this is a lot harder than what I was expecting. Okay, so. I don't think these are gonna match. I think they're all gonna be like, kind of like different sizes and all over the place. Like I don't know what I'm gonna think about these. Cause you can't like pair them up. Like you literally just have to like grab one, stick it on and hopefully you like it. Like that's what I'm getting from this because they don't match. Like none of this stuff matches. They're all like, they all look different. Um, they're not what you would be expecting. I mean, it looks okay though. Like it doesn't look bad. Like there's my two pinkies. So we'll go with that. We'll see what happens. I'm gonna stop it for a little while and try and stick the rest of these things on there and I'll let you know what I think. Okay guys, so I kind of figured out that certain ones have certain looks. So some of the bigger sizes have the same look, some of the smaller sizes have the same look so that they won't look weird if you end up getting like a size one and a size zero or something like that. But this is what they ended up kind of looking like. I think they look pretty good. Like I kind of got it figured out a little bit of what I wanted. The only ones that don't really match are gonna be these ones right here. So I'm just gonna leave them because I don't really care. And because, I mean, this isn't like anything professional. Like no one's gonna be taking pictures of my hand. But anyway, I think these look pretty good. They're interesting. Um, 
These ones are like $4.99, five, something like that. I mean, to go get your nails done like this and actually have them done done would take like a good hour and a half or something like that. It just depends on your your um, nail person. And then also it could, you know, like cost like 50 something, 60 bucks. It just depends on like what you want to do. So anyway, this is a good option. Um, I'm going to leave them and I'll let you guys know tomorrow what they look like. I feel like they're okay. They're not exactly like... I don't know. I mean, they're pretty good. I mean, you can't really go too wrong with something like this and with them not costing a lot. But anyway, let me know what you think about them. You guys should try them out. Tell me what you think. Um, I'm going to do another uh, video tomorrow, I think, on some tanning stuff. And then I'm going to um, tell you guys more about this. I'm going to talk about some stuff that happened just recently. Um, I guess there was a general that was shot um, or killed or something like that over in um, Syria, I think. Anyway, um, so I might talk about that a little bit tomorrow, but just let me know what you think about this. This looks really pretty interesting, so try them out.